I mean, it feels like the sun exploded. You cannot believe the release of energy. It's like a siren comes on, a siren which you hear and feel, a siren which shakes your body and the building that you're in and everything else. And then it just, you know, pushes you out into, who knows, long periods of time where not a word of it will ever be reported to any other human being. I mean, you see things that nobody has ever seen and will ever see again. You're into it, you know, and, and it's an infinite matrix in all directions. And it means something. It doesn't just look pretty. You know, it's playing on the harp of your soul with the emotional overtone. I don't know, I've got, you know, some anxiety for the last mm, week or so. Mm, I feel like I am more anxious these days, you know, a bit nervous. So, and now I, I really have these mushrooms. And yeah, I started with the first gram. I was planning to take three because um, I am not a beginner. <laughs> Okay, there's no way back. <laughs> Mac Miller is with us, tripping today. Hi, Mac. We hope I hope you're doing well there. Oh, like you remember the Paul Stamets yesterday said like woof, a mm -hmm. or wave. That was a wave. So are you seeing or feeling anything? Nothing, but I felt like a wave through my body, like, like this. Okay. That's why I was like, whoa, I, it's, it was so unexpected. Like, because you see, I'm relaxed and I feel like from up, it, like, especially here where the heart is, it was like a very strong wave from the up to down okay. on my body. And now I have a goosebumps. Oh, I had the goosebumps too. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay, that's, that's it. Some people say it comes on very quickly and so forth and so on. For me, it usually doesn't really come on until the hour and 20 minute mark. And it comes as a wave. It's literally, it's almost like a, a very sheer silk scarf just drops over me just settles over and I think, oh my god, here it comes, here it comes. And then it, it comes and it's, a, it's a, a wave of hallucination. Um, I'm trying to record this <laughs> review. Can we call it a review? Um, I'm trying to record this review for several days now. This is the third day since I took my mushrooms and I had this... I'm calling it like a breakthrough for myself since um, I've been taking mushrooms for five times in my life, I guess. Um, and that one was the most powerful I've ever had. All my previous um, sessions mushroom sessions were such a kindergarten <laughs> in comparison to what I've been through this Sunday. Usually when I was taking mushrooms I, will, I could walk, I could talk, I could, I don't know, express what I, what I see, what I feel. Well, this last mushroom session I did talk and walk in the beginning, the, then I so I was going to have a look for Julia and there she is on the floor again but this time in the living room not outside I walk if I start walking I, it's difficult for me <coughs> so she took three grams it's been two and a half hours 
I guess. And I um, went to the dark room. Damn, it was. Uh, Oh my god, I can't imagine. She still has a bit to go. She's a bit tired, she says, but she can't sleep. I'm very tired. But um, so far, so good. We will get through this. <laughs> <laughs> no. Wow, these mushrooms are very strong. This is one of, I think, the strongest trip ever with me. I think that after three days after the trip, I forgot some of the things. You should really record right after the trip because, you know, but anyways, I'm still processing what happened to me. I still, this is the third day and I'm, I still think about it. I still try to understand what was that. You can't believe this is happening, quote unquote, in my mind but you lose it. it a lot of it does not transcribe into short-term memory and then after about an hour or 40 minutes of that it becomes more manageable more memorable uh, the most mind-boggling parts of it are just not possible to bring out of it because language fails because english there are no words i saw the, my my birth and my death. I mean, not the um, not the past and the future. No, I just saw. I think my ego dying. It was like um, six hours, like hard hard rock therapy. <laughs> I am happy that I did go through. Um, therapy with my psychologist that lasted for about five months uh, because uh, I was more ready to take mushrooms after the therapy and that was a good idea Whew. they showed me oh, they showed me the universe they showed me the galaxies different galaxies it was so beautiful. Maybe because I like um, I like the sky and I like the space. I don't know, but it was so beautiful. I want to cry. It was an amazing experience. Now, this question about fear, which is a real question, because when everything begins to slide, if you are not, if it's, it's, it's more than most people who haven't done it expect. They have heard it, they've read the books, they, they, but they think it's a metaphor. They don't understand. It's really going to happen, and it's really going to happen to you. I was scared too. There were situations when I saw death and war and terrible, scary things, but darkness, there was like... I don't know, a huge, huge death coming to me. I don't know, I cannot explain. I don't really remember the details. But I remember when I was really scared and I thought that I'm dying. It, it's really scary. And you cannot change, you cannot fucking stop it. You cannot control it. You cannot just, oh, okay, guys, okay, I've seen enough. Please just turn it off. I did ask them. They were like, no way. Once you get into this path walk until the very end and learn a lesson i wish you an amazing trip everyone wherever you are whenever you take mushrooms or other psychedelics i wish you to learn and to take as much information as you can from the trips enjoy your trips and see you on the other side